of video number seven. In this specific video, you're going to learn how to use the DigiResults affiliate system. Just a quick overview here. I'm going to talk about how to use the DigiResults affiliate system first, and then I'm going to show you how to create affiliate promotional tools for your affiliates. So let's talk about how to use the DigiResults affiliate system. You have to manually approve all of your affiliates with DigiResults. And the good benefit about that is because you will get spammy affiliates that will apply to your DigiResults affiliate program. So you want to make sure that you manually approve the legitimate affiliates and disprove the affiliates that are not legitimate. Now the thing about digital results that I like is you will receive an email that so and so has applied to your affiliate program. And whenever you receive this email, what it has is the person's name, their email, and a reason why they want to apply for your program. Or a reason why you should possibly accept them in terms of how they are going to promote your affiliate program because you don't want to have somebody who is spamming a, you know promote your affiliate program because that will not be very good on your reputation now you will notice that to the left of each of the affiliates that apply to your affiliate program the people with a badge next to their name are affiliates that have been producing great commissions. By producing commissions, they get a badge next to their name, and these are the types of affiliates that you want to approve to your program because they are people with a proven track record who have been making commissions for other products on digital results. So the best way to go about doing this is to prove them, contact them, try to build a relationship with them, and ask if they need any help and be personable. So let me go ahead and show you how to use the Digital Results Affiliate System. So managing your affiliates is very, very easy to do. All you need to do is go to digitalresults.com, click on Manage, click on Affiliates, and click on Approve Affiliates. And Digital Results will also notify you whenever somebody applies to your affiliate program. Now the downside is some of these people I know for a fact are spammy affiliates. So it's a good thing that you can approve affiliates on a manual basis. But as you can see here, if you select a person, you can select how you want to pay them either instantly, 7 days, 14 days, 30 days, 45 days or 60 days, or you can also reject them. And it's clear to me that this is a spammy email. So I'm going to go ahead and click on apply to select it. But for those people that are legitimate, obviously you want to select instant or something quicker. And if you may not know them as well, you can always email them ahead of time, which is normally what I do before I approve them. Now let's talk about creating affiliate promotional tools for your affiliates. Banner ads are great. and the best place to create banner ads is a site called Fiverr.com. That's F-I-V-E-R-R.com. And I found this is the best place to find people to create banner ads for cheap. I personally use Fiverr.com and I found people to create banner ads for around five to ten dollars. Email solo ads is another great affiliate promotional tool that your affiliates are going to need, especially if they have a list. The secret to creating email solo ads is by simply looking at your sales letter and copying the headlines, the subheadlines, the bullet points that stand out from your sales copy into your email ad, then of course rewrite it because congruency is important. And that is often the key to increasing your conversions. In other words, somebody goes and they reads your email. If they see the same headline, the same subheadline, and the same bullet points on your sales copy after they have clicked over from the email copy, then they feel like, okay, this is the same email. They clicked on the email ad because they want exactly is listed in the email ad. 
if they clicked over and they go to the sales copy and realize that everything is actually different, then most likely your conversion is going to drop. So that's just a really cool tip that you can use in your email solo ads when you create your affiliate promotional tools for your affiliates. Google AdWord ads are another affiliate promotional tool that you can create for affiliates that want to promote your product using pay-per-click marketing. A great tool to use to create these ads is using KeywordSpy.com or a site called SpyFU, SpyFu.com. And if you simply find your competitors, enter their domain name into KeywordSpy.com or keywords that relate to your product, you're gonna see what your competitors are creating in terms of pay-per-click ads. Don't necessarily copy them, but use similar keywords. You can rewrite the ad and create some ads so that your affiliates have something in hand. So just go to keywordspy.com, enter your competitors websites and figure out the ads they're writing. Also create a list of keywords. You can use the method above to grab a list of keywords and add it to the list of the following keywords. Here's some ideas of keywords that you can use. You can put your product name plus review, product name and then bonus, product name and then your, your name as the author and so forth. So these are just a list of promotional tools that you can go ahead and place onto your affiliates page right